hi guys welcome to another video on my channel okay so today we're going to talk about firmware 13.3.5 new features and we have four new features by the way i just want to emphasize only one feature that is very important to me and maybe it is also important to you that is about the thumbnail creator so in previous version we can create a youtube thumbnail using firmware 13. by the way we have to wait until we finished exporting the project then we can have the thumbnail but now they added a new feature that we can export the thumbnail separately so it is very interesting and they mentioned that this video is not sponsored by wondershare i just want to make video about femora because i love using the program but if you want to support my channel you can use my affiliate links in the description when you purchase the software it can help you save your money and also support my channel okay i will put my coupon code link right here okay just click here here or here all right and this is my femora 13.3.1 and now if i want to upgrade to this latest version i want to go to have here and then check for update okay and this is going to share femora 13.3.5 release and current version is 13.3.1 and number one they upgraded take to speech model and they are improving transcription accuracy and number two enhanced video thumbnail capabilities supported for exporting only thumbnail so it is very important we don't have to export the whole project to get the thumbnail okay number three improve text functionality focusing on fixing text related issue by the way i have no idea about the issue Okay, and number four, as, as usual, fix some bugs and optimize performance. And now we need to click here, update to get this latest version. Okay, just click here. And it will download a package to your computer. And it will install after it finished. Okay, I will install it and open Femora in just one second. Let's go. 2000 years later. Okay, and this is my Femora 13.3.5. And the first new feature is is that they have more model at the text to speech option by the way i have no idea how many model they have so we can check it by drag and drop a title here on the timeline and double click at the title and we see there is a text to speech okay and we can select the language here and select the model later okay this is a voice or the model so we have news narration news ads social media educational stuff like that so but, but they have many here so we can see many voice actor here i have no idea how many they have okay so that is the first new feature in femora 13.3.5 and the second one is about the new thumbnail creator so for example we want to if we want to create a thumbnail for our youtube video or edit a thumbnail or stuff like that we want to click the export button okay and here's a export window you want to click here at the edit button to edit your thumbnail just click here and then you have a new window to edit your thumbnail and you see here we have many templates here you can select the template for example i can select interview and download a template here to to edit it as my youtube thumbnail but this is a new button export to local so whenever you finish your editing you can click here at the export to local okay just click here and now the program will export this thumbnail and save it to your exported folder okay and the export is finished and you can click here to view okay. i have no idea why it just disappears so quickly so we have to click the export to logo again and click here to view by the way it is in your exported folder okay i created an exported folder here it is my external drive so this is the thumbnail and you see i have many thumbnail here okay and this is the thumbnail we can use this thumbnail on our youtube video okay so that is the new feature in femora 13.3.5 and the next one is fixing issue about text editor and also optimizing the performance of the program by the way i have no idea about this thing so that's all for today's video i hope this video is helpful for you if you have any questions just let me know in the comment section below and if you're new here consider to subscribe to my youtube channel for more videos like this thank you very much for watching and i will see you in my next video goodbye